the demonstration of experiment 2 SK025 which is determining the heat of reaction. In this experiment, you will determine the heat capacity of a calorimeter and the heat of neutralization of hydrochloric acid and sodium hydroxide solution. In part A of the experiment, hot water is used to determine the heat capacity of a calorimeter. This is calorimeter with a lid. First, measure the temperature of an empty calorimeter. Record the readings. Pipette 50 ml of distilled water into a 100 ml beaker. Then, heat the beaker to a temperature between 50 to 60 degrees Celsius. the 50 ml of the hot water into the calorimeter and immediately close the calorimeter with the lid. Measure the initial temperature of the hot water. Observe the decrease in temperature of the hot water every 10 seconds for 2 minutes. the temperature that remain constant. From the result, you can calculate the heat capacity of the calorimeter. Let's move to part B of the experiment. In part B, the neutralization reaction between 1.0 molar hydrochloric acid and 1.0 molar sodium hydroxide is carried out to determine the heat of neutralization reaction. Pipette 25 ml of 1.0 molar sodium hydroxide solution into the calorimeter. Also, 25 ml of 1.0 molar hydrochloric acid solution into a beaker. Measure and record the initial temperature of each solution.
then pour the hydrochloric acid solution into the calorimeter and immediately replace the lid of the calorimeter. Stir the solution to ensure the solution become homogeneous. Measure and record the maximum temperature reached. Result and heat capacity of the calorimeter in part A calculate the heat of neutralization. 